Good morning, everybody. How y'all doing? Good. I don't know if I like this. But... Oh, well. <laughs> uh, I'm over here in Dallas right now. Some store. Probably, that, probably not even the safe spot, but hey. I got a guy with me, so I ain't tripping. Good morning, everybody. How's everybody doing? I hope everybody's having a good day. Uh, make sure you go to church. Make sure you pray. Make sure you do a YouTube something. Uh, read the Bible. I'm going to finish. Uh, uh, no, nah, I'm not going to finish John 4. <clears throat> but um, I just want to read. Um, we'll read first. I was, yesterday, I was reading First John, and I started raining or something. And... Um, So, it says, uh, everyone who has been born from God does not practice sin for his seed remains in such one and he cannot practice sin for he has been born from God. The children of God and the children of the devil are evident by this fact. Whoever does not practice righteousness does not originate with God, nor does the one who does not love his brother. For this is the message that you have heard from the beginning, uh, that we should love one another. Not like Cain, who originated with the wicked one and slaughtered his brother. And for what reason did he slaughter him? Because his own works were wicked, but those of his brother were righteous. Do not be surprised, brothers, that the world... Uh, sorry, I like to make eye contact every once in a while, but I, I do that and I, I lose my spot. <laughs> uh, I'm practicing, I'm practicing. Uh, do not be surprised, brothers, that the world hates you. We know that we have uh, passed over from death to life uh, because we love the brothers. The, the one who does not love remains in death. Everyone who who everyone who hates his brother is a murderer and you know that no murderer has everlasting life remaining in him this we have come to know love because that we, that one surrendered his life for us we are under our obligation to surrender our lives for our brothers but whoever has the material possessions of this world and sees his brother in need and yet refuses to show him compassion in what way does this love of god remain in him Little children, we should love, not in the word or with the tongue, but in deed and truth. But this is this will we know that we originate with the truth and we assure our hearts before him regarding whatever our hearts may condemn us in. Because God is greater than our hearts and knows all things, beloved ones. If our hearts do not condemn us, we have freeness of speech toward God, and whatever we ask, we receive from him because we are observing his commandments and doing what is pleasing in his eyes. Indeed, in His this is his commandment, that we have faith in the name of his son, Jesus Christ, and love one another just as he gave us a commandment. Moreover, the one who observes his commandments remains in union with him and in union with such one, and by the spirit that he gave us, we know excuse me we know that he remains in union with us I'm in a different city and um people just a little bit more uh what do you call it not ballsy but they're a little bit more not antsy but a little bit take of a chance you know what I'm saying they, they take a they take of a chance more and uh Cause like I'm parked right here, right, and this car just kept like this car came like right there, like he just had to go right there in front of me. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, man, man. So don't let me get there. Uh, don't let me call my angels. Nah, just playing. And there's a sun. The sun comes out. God bless you. The sun comes out. So uh, I hope everybody has a good day today. Make sure you use. Uh, let's stay in prayer. Let's stay in prayer real quick. I got to get going. So, Heavenly Father, Father God, uh, please protect me, keep me safe, Father. Hold on real quick. I, now that I walk going in circles, I might have to get out of here pretty soon. This ain't my city. Jehovah God, please protect me and keep me safe. Jehovah God, in the name of Son Jesus Christ, we pray. Thank you, Father. 
Thank you, Jehovah. We know that you are there, Jehovah. We know that you love us, Jehovah God. We know that your spirit will, will uh, provide what we need to 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 reach everlasting life, Jehovah God. So please forgive us for our sins when we come up short. <clears throat> Excuse me. Thank you for allowing me to get here safely, Jehovah God. And uh, so we just want to thank you for everything you do. Please forgive us for our sin again. And uh, just uh, we ask that you help us and uh, not help. Well, yeah, you help us, Jehovah God. We ask that your spirit be with us every step, step of the way. I think I did you just say that, but we're going to say it again. And may God bless you. And, uh, and uh, thank you, Jesus Christ, for everything you do. So may we show one each other, each other, uh, may we show one another each other love. And may we show each other uh, God's will, God's way, and that's by being loving, kind, compassion, uh, everything good, you know. So we just thank you, Jehovah God, for everything. Please forgive us for our sin again. Thank you, Father. In the name of your Son, Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. Y'all have a day. God bless. Thank God for everything. Uh, to, to my cousins and to my aunts that were telling me good morning, good morning, good morning. I hope y'all are okay. And, um, yeah, y'all have a great day. Stay blessed. Thank you.